to our channel on today's i'll show you how you can zip and unzip file and how you can fix the problem with zip files okay so we'll just go through very common problems and which is about the extracting your files correctly and so this is the symbol like if your file is zipped this zip kind of symbol appears in front of your folder so basically it's all about compressing your files on the minimal size okay so the for example we have taken the one zip file so here's the zip file and if you double click on that yeah this will open okay so this is already inside the file and I will just right click on this and I'll go through this 7 zip and then you can extract so which means you can directly unzip your file right over here right click on that okay then click extract all okay so yeah it was asking if the same folder to extract so I'll just allow it to or you can change the directory or you can browse the directory okay so I'll just allow it to extract right over here alright so as you can see the new file is created right yeah so that's it is okay so let's unzip this so this is uh, no this is the extracted version and how we can zip this again so I'll right click again and then we'll go through this 7 zip okay then I'll go through this add to or I can just compress to tally ERP with crack 7 and email so yeah basically what you can do is you can compress and send directly to your email or you can just compress an email so add to archive so I'll just go through this add to archive okay so I'll just click OK so yeah now my files is zipping okay so I'll wait till it get finished alright so now, now the file is zipped again okay so this is the file you can directly send it in email so we can check the difference like if we check the size of this file this 229 MB and this is also about the same size and this size this file is about a 19 MB so which is compressed okay so this that's how you can zip and unzip files on Windows and if you encountered any problem it's about the corrupt program or corrupt zip file on that case you can't do anything you can just delete and you can download again you can zip and unzip again okay thank you so much for watching